Time you run. So much at stake on this final day of Champions Cup action live on BT Sports. Stade Francais and Connacht get us underway. Offside. Advantage though being played to Connacht again. Prendergast is skipped. The ball doesn't go to hand. Crossfield kick is from Sammy Arnold. Gathered by Wooten. Inside one and towards the line. And has he done it down? He has. And boy, do they take it. What a great start for Connor. Great footwork by Wooten. I mean, the like pass he got out wide wasn't, he wasn't in the best uh, position, but his feet got him out of trouble. But it's all about the build up. It's about being patient. Look at the pick and go here. Getting it out the back. The pass doesn't go to hand, but you know, they stay patient. Lovely cross so field kick. Kind of and Wooten still has a lot of work to do here. Great footwork, and he has the strength to just squeeze over and reach out over the line. Great start for Connor away from home. Oh, fantastic. Didn't he do well? That was the move. Uh, not much when he was that close to the line that Laumape could do to stop him, tried everything. Lots of prospects ahead alongside Laumape in that midfield for Stade Francais as Latou goes to a line out and a quick peel around for Brasilien back to Lafegue on the wraparound and he's bounced off one or two and he's almost there and he's over! He is over! Adrien Lafegue in! It seemed like there was too much to do, there was huge traffic in the way but he found a way. Fantastic finish from the winger. A lovely little run from Lepeg back inside, had a lot of work to do to finish off, but great footwork, great fend, and reaches out there, just manages to get over the line. That was your, that was your really idea, strong finish it? from him. Good clean ball from the line out is what set it up, but it was right off the training ground. But look, one, two, three, Connacht will look at the defending. It was a bit of a pinball in there. He came away and over the line he finds himself. Yeah, obviously a pre-rehearsed -re -pre move. Yeah, Delahunt breaks out wide. Nothing nothing more he can do, but it's his inside man. Someone needs to connect with him on the inside. But Alain Emile bursts through. And into the 22 he goes. Brasilier caught by Prendergast, who just couldn't resist the temptation. But That's secondly, play, diving in off your feet. You can't, you can't come into a ruck and dive off your feet. You have to keep your feet. So not alone do Stade right, Francais going. not have the try, but they're now down to 14 men. Get more than just three. And they go about that by setting up the all from the line out. And at the back is Delahunt. Down it goes. Another advantage for Connor Blade. Can see the gap and Blade is over. Caelan Blade, he's taking a bang on the way through but he has the second try for Connacht. Great awareness, great speed, great pace. Yeah, exactly. And Kestets, a lovely finish. Yeah, Castets like hit him hard and hit him high. Sets it up. And in comes Hall to Stets out on their way. They know what they need to do. They need to find a bonus point try win. And Sanchez goes about setting them in this second half. And on they go. And Laumape! Wooten there to make the tackle, but the New Zealander, every sinew twitching, gets there. Just Stad have the perfect start to the second half. But great play. Look, there are a man down here as well. Sanchez, he's looked dangerous all day. A little bit of a disconnect, a missed tackle, but great hands. Everyone else offering La Mape just has enough pace with the covering tackle, and he reaches out and gets over for a fantastic team try. Still have the pace. Yeah, and Sanchez the <laughs> made the break in off the ball. Referee <laughs> Wayne Barnes having a little word about him. The old man still has the pace. Advantage being played. Like that Penalty again. comes. And Latu's in all sorts of trouble. All sorts of trouble. Good night, good luck, and goodbye. It was seven at the break. It's just five now tackle, as Jared Butler is put to ground by oh, Hall. Caelan Blade. Arnold, lovely offload, Farrell, that's beautiful, really impressive from Connacht, great hands, great awareness. Thanks, mate. They've really stepped up the gears. Yeah, Blade just arcing and tempting defenders to come at him. Third, but it's a scrum half who tries to wiggle his way there. Hall just an inch or two short. And let go now. Connacht scrambling D again. Sanchez will go in and play scrum half. Shifts it on. Goes to the full back and in he goes. Hamnoui is in. Stade Francais are not finished yet. Cilier, a great little break at the you know around the breakdown, picking out the front five, finding a little gap. Straight down the throat of Mac Hansen. 
head up, ball in one hand. Makes coaches nervous, but grabs a hold of it before it's grabbed a hold of by one of the stat defenders, Caelan Blade, Jack Carty, Arnold, and then Jared Butler, and Butler into a hole, and then Oliver's on his shoulder. Oh, wonderful, wonderful! Jared Butler and Connacht take advantage of the space they knew was out there. 15 against 14. They found the space and they executed right out of the top drawer. Slight little step, gets him outside the defender. But look, great lines, and he gets the ball back here on the inside, goes over for the try. But, you know, look, Connor looks so dangerous, so threatening. Really, really good from Butler, finding the space, and then a little bit. Should they do it? Thank you. They'd still very much be in this. It goes wide, and in they will go. Chapuis is in. It's a fourth try. For Stade Francais, it cuts the margin. Just stops and checks. Laumape carrying hard here, getting over the gain line. Yeah, got to the bit. Really strong. But look on the way back, Sanchez's feet here. Managed to stop his feet. That's a hard skill to do when you're going at pace. Controls his feet, gets a pass away. That's a lovely team try from Makalu. A man down. Yeah, that's really good work from Stade Francais. Nice. Kind of changing their binds. Penalty. Awarded. Van der Mesh takes it up. Advantage being played to Stade Francais. They feel the momentum has swung back their way. And La Pahega is going to get in again. Would you believe this? Getting it over the uh, blitz defence of Connor. And what footwork to stay in. Big, exciting last five minutes. Yuri Sekons. Stad's hopes. On his shoulders, off the post, still in play. Where's it going to go? Oh, this game. Who wrote the script? It's literally got everything. And we're not done yet. Mac Hansen with 20 seconds breaks through and the referee shrill blast to the whistle. He's offered another penalty to Stade Francais. To make it into the top eight for the moment, at least. And cheer will tell you everything you need to know. They've done it. Stade Francais in the most remarkable of games with the most fantastic of dramatic endings.